All right, guys, fire away. So what did you do first thing today? Uh, we had breakfast in bed with my family at the hotel. <laughs> <laughs> Has it sunk in yet? No, not even close. I mean, I'm just digesting everything. 24 hours ago, I was uh, hadn't even voted yet and had no idea where we were going to be. And uh, here I am today. I've already talked to the folks in Washington about the, uh, the, the transition training next week. So it's, and I've received a lot of calls from people, and uh, my phone is, you know, as you might imagine, is blowing up. So it's a lot, of, a lot to digest, but we're we're ready. We're up to the task. When, uh, I'm not shocked. Was it was it a pleasant surprise? Yes, but it wasn't a total surprise. And I'll tell you why. Because, you know, last several weeks you could just really feel the momentum shifting. You know, and I made hundreds of calls and knocking on probably thousands of doors, and we we're knocking on doors of just Republicans, Independents, and some Democrats, and and we were getting a resoundingly favorable opinion of things. So I felt that something good was going to happen. And it was funny, I wasn't nervous at all last night, at all. But um, I, I didn't realize it was going to be this big, but it's clear that we could feel the momentum shifting. There's no, no doubt about it. What? It's very important. I, I, we're, we're, it, I am not going to take part in extremism. It's just not going to happen. And uh, if they think I am, I'm gonna, they're going to be sorely disappointed. I think that the Republicans have, we have both houses, you know. We have no, we have no more excuses, right? We have no more excuses. We, we have to do things and get things done. And... Uh, it's a wonderful opportunity, but it's also a pretty significant responsibility, and we have to uh, we have to uh, we have to be up for it. Because in two years, uh, people are going to say, you know, you had the House and the Senate. What have you got done? You know, and uh, we've got to get some things done. But, uh, about the orientation in Washington next Yeah, week? yeah, it's going to be busy. What yes. Uh, well, they, basically, it's a soup to nuts. You know. Uh, you know, go in. Here's what here's what it's going to be like. Everything from discussing your budget for your office and your staff to, uh, uh, you know, uh, how you know. I think there's even going to be some uh, discussion on leadership posts, and you know, this, you'll start talking about committees and things like that. Everything. So how does that work? You sort of raise your hand for certain committees. Or um, well, you, you start making known what you what you want to be a part of, and stuff. And we're, we're in the process of discussing what we want to prioritize because I think you got to go down with the strategy of if you really want. A committee, you got to work for that committee, and we're working on which ones we want to be involved in. And what's what is your expectation for a new congressman to, you know, get a committee assignment or a leadership position? Well, I mean, they're going to obviously assign me to committees. I mean, I want to. I don't. I don't want to just be thrown out of committee. I'm going to. I'm not the kind of that's going to sit there and say, "Thank you, sir. I might have another." So I'm going to. Um, I'm going to ask for. Uh, I'm going to. I'm going to tell them what I want. I'm not going to wait for them to tell me what they want me to do. What do you want? Um, I haven't decided yet, at some, but I'm mindful of the I-81 project and how I can best make sure we get that properly funded and it's in a good, that's in a, that, think about that, that is the biggest uh, civic project in the history of our central New York, think about that, mm -hmm. right? So let's get it right, and there's been a lot of talk about getting it right, but it's time to roll up our sleeves and do it, and then now the time is now, and I'm in a unique position to coming in to get on, a, to do that, so that's a high priority, and anything with jobs and the economy is important too.